Okay, our game is PAP, Protect Against Plagiarism, Build Your Defences. That is a student version, but the staff one is BAPS, Build Against Plagiarism System. Nettie is our marketing guru. Um, <laughs> this is a game based on our learning objective of helping students to understand the concept of plagiarism and what is plagiarism, um, specifically self-plagiarism we want to get across, but it's broadened out a little bit as the game has gone on. So, it is designed for a two to six teams to play, with two to six people in said team, and it's sort of designed for the transition between the end of first year and beginning of second year at university. Um, each team is given a base stone of one colour and a number of other blocks of the same colour with which they will build a tower as they go along. So I'm going to shuffle the cards. There is a mixture of question cards and wild cards so they have control over the consequences with the question card but no control over what happens with the wild card. So it carries on. Each team is given 10 cards um, and they have 10 minutes to answer it, which will be controlled um, with a timer on the big board that they can all see. So the first question here is, I've used the same quote in two essays on different topics. Is this okay? Yes or no? So you decide whether that is okay or not. I say yes, it is okay. So you build one block onto your tower as instructed. And each question card has a similar um, answer if you get it wrong or if you say no when it should be yes, it's usually remove one block from your tower. The wild cards have things like you find out a peer attained an A after using your work, they have been penalised. And the thing that you do as a result of that is to take two blocks from another group. So you've got to go and take two blocks off someone else's tower and bring it back and put it on your own. Um, at the end of the 10 minutes, um, whoever has the highest tower is the winner. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Good. Mm -hmm.